Hey guys, what's up? Tuesdays with Todd for December 21st. Um, got a two-sided list to get through tonight, but I'm going to try to get through it quick. Uh, first thing I want to say is I apologize about missing last week. Um, I was pretty much on, I was pretty much sick from like Monday afternoon through, uh, well, I'm still not completely better, but um, I was on the couch all day Tuesday. I mean, I couldn't even get up. Uh, Wednesday most of the day Thursday I kind of trickled around but um, <clears throat> as I said before uh, you know I'm at the mercy of you know what I got going on you know with the Crohn's disease so you know it, it's not so much that it's just the medicine I'm on affects my immune system pretty badly so I'm susceptible to bugs and flus and sinus and chest colds and junk like that so um, you know that's what I had going on so again I apologize I'm still not 100% seems like I can't I can't get ahead I, you know I'll, I'll be sick and I'll do good for a little while and then it hit me again so guys just gotta you know just just bear with me if you can I'm a little bit behind I think uh, well, I, I didn't get all the shipping done today for Tuesday so um, we're gonna try to work that out tomorrow morning uh, everything through maybe Friday is shipped so it's just stuff over the weekend <clears throat> I'm a little bit behind on my uh, emails and uh, YouTube and uh, FFI messages. So, like I said, uh, bear with me. I'll get to you as soon as I can. <clears throat> um, last week, we were supposed to have a winner uh, of the backwards graphic deck. Uh, we'll do that this week. And the random winner is YouTube subscriber Blossom. So send me a message and uh, we'll get, get your information and get that right out to you. Um, <clears throat> excuse me guys um, next thing tomorrow night uh, sometime in the later evening I'll be putting up a, a pre-Christmas sale kind of deal uh, I'll have some really good price on some decks and a, you know a few sets of wheels some grip tape and some miscellaneous things so you guys might want to check that out there's no set time uh, just we we have some stuff going on during the day so when I get home tomorrow night I'll put it up and as of you know tomorrow all orders from tomorrow through next Tuesday will ship on Wednesday so there's going to be a little bit of delay because of the holidays uh, so you know if you had something you want to try to get for Christmas it's, it's not going to be possible uh, it's, you know it's, it's Tuesday now so uh, but you know it's still great prices you know if you want to wait just a little while to get the stuff you know pick it up check it out um, <clears throat> you know like I said, that'll be up tomorrow night, Wednesday, Wednesday night. Um, the few more things here, the snowboards are still delayed a little bit. Um, part of the device that is used to make them is not completely done as I thought it would be. So um, as soon as I can get back to it, I'm going to be working on that. So I would say I promise, but I might end up breaking it. But I'm going to do my best um, to get those done by like the first first week or two in January maybe. Uh, still cold, still snow out there in a lot of places so you guys can still enjoy them. <clears throat> um, quick update on uh, Project FAIS. Um, it is actually now named um, the Revo Project um, and I'm going to be release, releasing some of the parts for the overall uh, thing, the overall deal. <laughs> probably the first part of January. Now I'm working on getting all that stuff ready as I can. Um, it's something that is kind of an addition to something that's kind of been made. Uh, and, and some people do make their own occasionally. Uh, you know, our plan was to, you know, do them, uh, you know, pretty close to the originals. Uh, so, you know, the first part of the puzzle will be released. So if, if you happen to be somebody who's made your own, uh, or bought some, you know, one of the other ones that has been bought, you know, has been made, um, you know, and again, what we're planning is nothing like anybody's done, so, I mean, it's totally different, but, uh, you know, those, that, that should be the first part of January. Um, <clears throat> more on that later on. Uh, we'll have our annual customer appreciation sale on, uh, I believe, Friday is the day. It's January the 14th. Again, like we always do, we'll have crazy prices, you know, it'll be limited in them products, but, 
you know, we'll give stuff away, you know, different things like that. So, you know, a few people's asked me about that. So keep an eye out. Uh, it's coming up January the 14th. Um, also got a new special edition curb uh, that'll be in hopefully in a couple weeks. Uh, it's a new color with some pretty cool packaging. Uh, if you guys remember the uh, original Sesh Savers wheels were packaged in a little roll of life saver style packaging. You know, something kind of creative like that with a little bit of play on something. That's, you know, that's, you know, that's where that's going. So keep an eye out for those. You know, like I said, hopefully in a couple weeks. <clears throat> Sorry guys, I'm still having a little bit of a throat problem. Grenadine is 7-Up all day long. Um, another thing that we may, we may be doing it after the first of the year is, <clears throat> oh, you can see these. I made one of these. Uh, while back, I was kind of playing with it. It was basically a little, uh, you know, little pot with a little greenery in it, but it's actually, uh, you know, make cast in house, uh, you know, similar to the uh, curbs. And, you know, we, we color the material to kind of give it a terracotta look. Got a little bit of a lip on it, like a pot, and got the little greenery in there that's, you know, stuck in there pretty good. So it's a cool little scenery obstacle. I know people find the little pots and stuff, but, you know, I, I, I like making, uh, you know, replica, scaled down replicas. So, you know, that may be something we might offer in the future and some other small. You know, I'm trying to trying to work on making a, a garbage dumpster and a few other things. You know, some something different that's not been done. So, you know, keep an eye out for that. You know, as my <clears throat> as my time and my health permits, you know, I'll be working on that. So some of those things. So, <clears throat> man, I'm sorry, guys, about the throat. <clears> throat> also, the remaining Homewoods, uh, the limited edition no comply. Homewood no comply decks. It had the special uh, real world graphic on those. I've got a handful of those left. We'll put those up on the site tomorrow night too. Everybody that you know was had had ordered one of those directly. You know, now we got a few left, so I'm just going to put those up. <coughs> um, just a few more things here, guys. I'm trying to get through this one quick. Uh, next, I want to give a big thank you to Jay Linen for organizing the gift exchange on uh, fingerflipinc.com, FFI. Um, I know he spent a lot of time, and, you know, he was telling me that he gave up some of his time for his, for his schoolwork to organize it, and it was a tall order with 50 people and organizing the names and getting in touch with everybody. So, man, I really appreciate that. I want to say thank you, Jay, for doing that. And I got something nice from my secret Santa. Um, <clears throat> my secret Santa was Miles from Creekwood and I had never tried a Creekwood and I was excited to get this deck because I, I hadn't never tried one so uh, I haven't set it up yet I just got a few days ago but it's a nice uh, I like green I like the color green on the bottom and I got some uh, Creekwood stickers uh, really nice stickers so I put these on some of the park pieces if I ever get to building on the park so you know I want to say thank you to Miles for that for sending that you know and I uh, appreciate this. And uh, again, thank you to Jay for uh, heading, you know, heading that up and organizing all that. So, um, <clears throat> team additions from the uh, tryouts. Of course, they're going. They're a little bit behind as well. Um, the plan is to announce those on January the fourth on the uh, episode of Tuesdays with Todd. So I'm going to be looking at those uh, sometime after Christmas and. Uh, you know judging all those so just you know that's the plan we'll announce that <clears throat> I still really haven't looked at any of them yet I want to do it all at, you know look at them all at the same time so um, Tuesday after Christmas I uh, got a few people coming in town I want to send a shout out to these people because uh, you know they wanted to make a trip and come up and you know you know hang out fingerboard and things like that so uh, a couple kids from Henderson Kentucky Chase and Micah uh, maybe coming up and then Drew and Sam from down by Louisville and uh, Kelly Ann uh, from down in, in uh, Tennessee um, you know I've been in the sh you know all those people have been up before so you know <clears throat> I appreciate you guys <clears throat> and the parents bringing you guys up and uh, hanging out for the day 
We'll probably have a special edition Tuesdays with Todd with everybody in there too. So yeah, check that out. Um, one uh, one final thing I want to say in closing. Uh, you know, thanks again as always for all the support and you guys sticking. You know, uh, you know, hanging tough while I'm going through my issues with my with my sickness and everything. I really appreciate you guys. And I also want to say Merry Christmas to all my friends, uh, online friends. There's a couple people I want to, you know, specifically mention, and it doesn't mean that if I don't mention you, I'm not thinking of you. But there's a few people that have helped me out a lot. Um, <clears throat> you know, and I want I want to spend a, send a special message to them and I hope they have a great you know Christmas and holiday season with their family. Uh, of course, it's Justin Rodriguez from Homewood. Um, you know, he's a he's an amazing person. I've said a hundred times. Uh, he's, you know, I, I don't want to ramble, but you know, coming to, coming in, into this and getting a chance to meet him was probably one of the best things that could ever happened, in my opinion, because I made such a good friend. And uh, I also want to thank uh, him and Wilkes. You know, he came up for the Huck Jam in April. Him and his wife. And stayed at the house for a few days and again that's that's one of the things I'll take with me till the end you know a friendship with him and you know have the honor to meet him and I also want to thank Peter Ringel uh, the old uh, used to run Preet um, he's been you know a big help behind the scenes to me and been a really great friend and you know I want to thank him as well so I want to thank all three of you guys uh, you know for for being there for me when I got problems, got questions, you know, sharing advice and just sharing stories. So you guys mean the world to me. I appreciate it. Um, and finally, all the uh, entire No Comply family, the team riders, the push family, you know, all the push team riders, you know, again, all my online friends, all my customers, all the parents who support their kids uh, in their, you know, in their, in their fingerboarding hobbies. So, um, you know, I hope that the year was great for everybody and I hope that everybody can have a great 2011 as it's coming up we'll have one more episode before the end of the year but you know I, I just want to tell everybody that I really appreciate everyone uh, everyone that I've came in contact everyone that I know that takes the time to talk to me you know I appreciate each and every one of you guys so um, that's that's a big thing I'm thankful for this season uh, wish I could be thankful for my health but you know hey we're dealt the cards were dealt so could be worse but you know I'll get through it so Again, guys, thanks again, and uh, we'll catch you guys later on. Peace.